I saw the movie Go-Karts, originally released in Australia on January 16, 2020, which I got to see the movie on the Netflix streaming service. Go-Karts is directed by Owen Trevor. It stars William Lauder and Richard Roxburgh. My rating for the movie Go-Karts is a 2 out of 5, and here's why. The movie is about a teenage boy who joins in in this local birthday party of a teenage girl who is having her party at a go-kart facility. There he would end up driving the go-karts and then he would get bit by the racing bug. Since he doesn't have any money and in order for him to keep racing again at this facility, he would end up working there with a very mysterious, stubborn, grumpy owner of that karting facility. With his desire to race and the owner kind of taking him in and he would train to become a better go-kart driver, thus trying to get to the level of this professional go-kart driver who beat him in that race he first did. This is a family movie. The story is straightforward, heartfelt, encouraging, very predictable. With a movie like this theme to go-karts and racing and motorsports, you would think I would like it, but in all honesty, I did not. I still found fun in watching it because there aren't many movies about go-karts out there. This movie did remind me of one particular Japanese anime called Kapita. The acting in go-karts was mediocre. Most of the acting from the owner was probably the best, but it seems like a lot of these are up and coming teenage stars. The directing was good. I did love watching the racing sequences, but for the most part, the directing was just simply serving the story. Like I said, even though it's themed after motorsports, I didn't really like it. I wish this movie could have been better. That is my review of the movie Go-Karts. Please give this video a like, subscribe to the Spellgo YouTube channel if you haven't, for more of my reviews and other content, and as always, thank you for watching.